Welcome to Moto Focus, your channel for the latest breakthroughs in automotive, aerospace, and military technology. Today, we take a deep dive into one of the most ambitious projects in modern aviation history, the 2026 Mikoyan MiG-41. Designed as the successor to the legendary MiG-31 Foxhound, this aircraft represents Russia's bold attempt to leapfrog current fifth-generation fighters and step into the realm of true sixth-generation hypersonic interceptors. The MiG-41 is not just another fighter. It is a symbol of the future, an aircraft designed to operate at the edge of space, outpacing missiles, rival aircraft, and even advanced defense systems. With its futuristic design, unparalleled speed, and next-generation technology, the MiG-41 has been hailed as a game-changer that could redefine air combat in the coming decades. Origins and Development the story of the MiG-41 begins with the Soviet Union's Cold War obsession with speed and altitude. Back in the 1970s, the MiG-31 Foxhound was introduced as a high-speed interceptor capable of countering American bombers and spy planes. But as threats evolved, particularly with the rise of stealth aircraft and hypersonic missiles, the MiG-31's capabilities began to show their age. Enter the MiG-41 also known by its internal designation as the PAKDP project. Developed by the Mikoyan Design Bureau, the aircraft was conceived as a next-generation replacement that could achieve hypersonic speeds, carry advanced weaponry, and operate in near-space conditions. Work accelerated in the early 2020s, with Russian defense officials confirming its role as a sixth-generation fighter and interceptor. By 2026, prototypes began showcasing capabilities that once seemed like science fiction. Hypersonic Speed and Performance At the core of the MiG-41's mystique is its hypersonic speed. While the MiG-31 was capable of Mach 2.8, the MiG-41 is reportedly engineered to exceed Mach 4, with some sources even suggesting speeds as high as Mach 5. To put that into perspective, the MiG-41 could traverse vast airspaces in minutes, intercepting targets before they even breach a nation's defenses. This level of speed demands revolutionary engineering. The MiG-41 employs next-generation composite materials capable of withstanding extreme heat generated at hypersonic velocities. Its engines, rumored to be based on hybrid ramjet and scramjet designs, provide sustained thrust at altitudes where conventional turbofan engines would stall. At high altitudes, the aircraft can potentially operate in the edge of the stratosphere, pushing into near-space flight envelopes once reserved for specialized reconnaissance aircraft like the State Route 71 Blackbird. Stealth and Survivability Unlike older Russian interceptors, which relied heavily on speed and firepower, the MiG-41 integrates stealth into its design. Radar absorbent materials, angular shaping, and advanced coatings reduce its radar cross section, allowing it to penetrate heavily defended airspaces. But stealth is only part of its defensive strategy. The aircraft is equipped with advanced electronic countermeasure suites capable of jamming enemy radars, spoofing incoming missiles, and creating electronic ghosts to confuse tracking systems. In addition, the MiG 41 is rumored to have directed energy weapon systems potentially lasers, that could neutralize incoming threats, from enemy aircraft to hypersonic projectiles. This combination of stealth, speed, and electronic warfare makes it one of the most survivable aircraft ever conceived. Advanced Weaponry A fighter is only as powerful as its arsenal, and the MiG-41 does not disappoint. It is expected to carry a wide range of next-generation weapons, including air-to-air -air missiles capable of operating at hypersonic speeds themselves. Long-range missiles like the R-37 successor give it the ability to intercept targets hundreds of kilometers away, while new hypersonic missiles extend its reach to strategic bombers, drones, and even satellites in low-Earth orbit. Reports suggest that the MiG-41 may also be equipped with anti-satellite weapons, giving it a unique capability to disrupt enemy reconnaissance and communication satellites. This blurs the line between an interceptor and a space combat vehicle, positioning the MiG-41 as not just a fighter of the skies but also a guardian of orbital domains. Cockpit and Pilot Integration At hypersonic speeds, pilot endurance becomes a limiting factor. 
That's why the MiG-41 cockpit integrates advanced human-machine interface systems. Pilots benefit from augmented reality helmets, full-glass cockpit displays, and AI-assisted flight systems that handle the most complex maneuvers. The AI on board isn't just an autopilot, it's an intelligent copilot capable of managing weapons, analyzing threats, and suggesting tactical maneuvers. This level of autonomy reduces pilot workload, making it possible to focus on mission-critical decisions rather than the overwhelming mechanics of flying at Mach 4 Plus. Drone and Unmanned Capability Another groundbreaking aspect of the MiG-41 is its adaptability as both a manned and unmanned platform. Russian defense officials have hinted at an optionally piloted configuration, meaning the MiG-41 can fly autonomously as a drone. This versatility allows it to take on dangerous missions without risking a pilot's life, particularly when engaging heavily defended targets or operating in near space conditions. This unmanned capability also ties into the larger ecosystem of sixth generation warfare, where fighters act as command nodes, controlling swarms of drones and integrating seamlessly into a network centric bat. Strategic importance The MiG 41 is more than just an aircraft, it's a statement. For Russia, it represents technological prestige and military deterrence. In an era where the United States is advancing its next-generation air dominance, NGAD, program and China is rapidly modernizing its air force, the MiG-41 serves as Russia's answer, a hypersonic interceptor designed to protect its vast airspace and project power on a global scale. The ability to intercept stealth bombers, cruise missiles, and even hypersonic weapons gives Russia a defensive shield few other nations can match. Its anti-satellite capability also introduces a new dimension to military strategy, where control of near-Earth space could become just as important as dominance in the skies. Challenges and Controversies Of course, no project of this scale comes without challenges. Critics argue that the cost of developing and deploying the MiG-41 could strain Russia's already pressured defense budget. Others question whether the hypersonic capabilities advertised can be achieved reliably in real-world conditions. Skepticism also surrounds the feasibility of its anti-satellite role, as space warfare remains largely untested and bound by international treaties. Yet, despite these doubts, the MiG-41 continues to progress, and with every prototype flight, more skeptics are silenced. Whether it lives up to its bold promises or not, the aircraft has already succeeded in shifting the conversation about the future of aerial combat. The future of air combat. The MiG-41 is not just about Russia. It's part of a broader arms race shaping the next generation of warfare. Hypersonic interceptors, AI-driven systems, and near-space operations are no longer speculative, they are becoming the new normal. The MiG-41 embodies this transformation, standing as both a product of today's geopolitical rivalries and a glimpse into tomorrow's battlefield. For enthusiasts, the MiG-41 is a symbol of ambition and ingenuity. For strategists, it's a tool of deterrence and power projection. And for the future, it's a reminder that air combat is evolving beyond dogfights into an era defined by speed, intelligence, and multidimensional warfare. Conclusion the 2026 Mikoyan MiG-41 is more than an aircraft, it is a vision of what comes next. Hypersonic speed, stealth integration, advanced weaponry, AI assistance, and near-space capability place it in a category all its own. Whether it becomes the backbone of Russia's defense or remains an elite, limited production marvel, one thing is certain, it has already made history as one of the boldest aerospace projects of the modern age. Moto Focus will continue to follow its journey, bringing you updates on the technologies, strategies, and breakthroughs shaping the future of aviation.